And uh, on the side, I'll just uh, keep this up so that I can see the comments. Okay. Okay, uh, where am I? Okay, YouTube, yes. Um, I don't want to switch to um, watch my comments on the side here because this thing kind of takes up a lot of stuff. And so um, I'm just going to watch my comments from over here. Sorry about that. Um, it took me a while to figure... I haven't live streamed using my computer in a while. Um, so, um, oh, no, 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 no. That's just going to make it trippy. Uh, but yeah. Oh uh, yes, I just posted a new video. So, but I haven't live stream in a while. So, um, I decided I would do Iron Heart. Dang it! Uh, forgot. Okay. Um. Uh, Uh, da, da, da. Project list, my bad. I went to Russification Roulette because I'm used to working on it. Okay. Okay, which of these should I do? I'm going to go to Ironheart because we just recently did the uh, Lithuania thing. So I have to turn up the volume because uh, otherwise, because that's how things work here. Uh, how many people are in the chat? Twenty-eight. Holy shit! Okay, great. Um, can I, am I being heard? Can you all hear me? Okay. Yes, I can hear myself. Okay, great. <laughs> all right. Uh, let us begin the game. Start with the new game. I don't know. Whoever you guys choose to aim for. No, I. this is not my first time playing the game. I created you. I know what you are like. I am an average man. Okay, nope. I forgot that triggers the backlog. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, it's because you're adorable. That's why this has happened to you, Lithuania. <laughs> Ah, I'm late, I'm late, I'm late, I'm late. What is wrong with me? I'm never late. I swore I set my alarm to get here 30 minutes early. Wait, not only is that going to show everyone that I'm insignificant, but I'm also that I'm irresponsible. Germany isn't going to let me lead another EU department ever again. I'm starting to get a stomachache. Oh yeah, I kind of uh, rebooted the game, so... Now that, um, now that, um, I rebooted the game, so now it's, um, less cringy, let's just say, so. So do I just go in or do I sneak in? I'm probably not going to do the voice today, voices today because I just remember my brother and his girlfriend are upstairs, but I have nothing else better to do, so. So what do we do first? All right, what do I do first? The chat, does the chat stop loading or am I just? Oh boy, we are quite conflicted today. Oh boy, what do we do? I am getting a 50-50 response here. Slightly more for sneaking in, so I'm going to sneak in quietly. Wait, only half of the nations are here. What is going on? Gosh dang it, I, that, that doesn't progress the game like it does in Russification Roulette. Damn it. Hmm. How unusual that he's late. 
I kind of, for this game, since I, I didn't really put um, many of the characters, like, in proportion to the background, I put them, like, on the side as if, like, you just so you let them know that they, let you know that they are speaking. They're not, so just so you know, just you're wondering why, if you're wondering why they are floating. Um, they're not really floating, that's just to show their expression while they're speaking. Whoa, dude, you look exhausted, is everything okay? What's going on? Wasn't the meeting supposed to start half an hour ago? No way, I'm only here because Wes made me come 30 minutes early. Early, but it's 10.35. No, it isn't. Russia always makes transitions, always make things glitch, but that's because he's freaking Russia. <laughs> Lithuania forgot to set his clock back an hour, da? My clock. I had a bit of a panic, too. Then I realized I had another hour. I forgot that Germany has a different time zone. I'm so late in my mind. Maybe it's because I had a hard time sleeping last night. I had that nightmare about Russia dressed as a ballerina again. So I have 20 minutes before the meeting. Who should I talk to? All right. Who do I talk to? Okay. Okay. Just gonna wait for you guys to catch up. Just Russia. Just Russia. So far, four votes for Russia, three votes for America. Three votes for Poland, uh, uh, for America. I'm getting 50-50 Russia and America right now, so. Just Ivan. <laughs> oh yeah, Belarus does have a sadism dungeon. That is correct. Hmm. Oh boy, I don't know who I want to go through for today. Oh uh, boy. Okay, okay. Um, since you guys are making memes of it, I'll go for Russia today. Russia, I need to talk to you about... Shh! Damn it, that's the wrong button again! Hmm? Why are you hiding behind a plant? Shh, but what is looking for me? Can you do me a favor and pretend you don't see me? What is that? Please? Oh no, there she is. I'm not here. Big brother, big brother, where are you? I have the marriage papers. It's so stereotypical. Hmm? You! Who, me? Yes, you. Catch it, bastard. Tell me where my brother is. Um, what's wrong with your face? You look like you're going to throw up. This isn't the look, this is my face. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> oh no, it's just a stomachache. I get them whenever I stress too much. How weak. Nations like you are so being weak. No wonder why you're swallowed by bigger nations. Anyways, where is my brother? Um, okay. Do we rat him out, or do we save Russia? Oh, Josh, girl. Oh, yeah, I was, um... Gosh, dang it. Oh, yeah, I love Josh, girl. He's, like, my favorite English voice actor. No one could deny the Belarusian thickness. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> save him. <laughs> okay, I'm getting more votes for to save him, so I'm gonna we're gonna save Russia. I don't know. I'm sorry. Gosh dang it! Wrong button again. <sighs> Useless as usual. I think that he went to the bathroom. I think I saw him leave the room not that long ago. 
Ah, thank you, Litva. You can't hear the footsteps and unsaid. Ah, oh, Lithuania, thank you. I owe you. Yeah, you're welcome. You're so reliable. This is why you're my favorite. Uh, would you like something for your stomach ache? I have medicine. Really? Of course, I know my Lithuania always dresses himself out, so I always carry medicine in case he needs it. Cover that luscious ass. Oh my gosh. Swiggity smoothie, save the booty. I love you all. That's really creepy, but consider it. Con besides, it looks like normal stomach medicine. I suppose I can trust him. Thank you. Thank you for saving me. We need to go for a drink sometime. Just you and me. Or you can go with Letty and I. He's so small, but he drinks a lot. So endearing. <laughs> It actually is confirmed by Himaruya that Latvia has never been drunk. So Latvia has no tolerance limit confirmed. <laughs> um, sure. So what is it you want to talk to me about? Okay, how do I put this? Did you... We are going to start the meeting. Everyone to your seats. Um, I'll talk later. Okay, farewell, Lithuania! Okay, since we're on the Russia route, we're going to um, do Russian things. And since at work I've been, um, let's just say, there's been a lot of complaints about Russia lately, so yeah. Oh. <sighs> oh, the meeting is over. What should I do now? Okay. Oh, I should probably tell Amino that I'm live streaming. So while you guys are deciding, I'm going to go do that. Okay. Oh, wait, no, wait. I forgot. We already decided to do Russian things. So yeah, we're doing the Russian stuff. No, go away. Ah, go away. Okay. It's been a long day. I need a drink or two. We could use a drink or two. What would you like, sir? You don't have salmon, do you? No, sir, we do not. Is there something else you would like? Vodka. Hard vodka. Give me the vodka. It's been a rough week. <laughs> Did somebody say vodka? Shit. Vodka! Ooh! <laughs> ah! Hey, Russia! I have all the- I have the vodka too! Hey, Lithuania, are you okay? Fine. You seem tense, da? Oh, wait, they're always tense. Why are you always so tense, Lithuania? Because I'm always under a lot of stress. Really, that can't be good for you. No, it isn't. Maybe one day I can give you back massage, da? Um... My back is in stores of lately, too. My entire family tends to have back problems. My sister has major back problems because of her boobs and her farming. My little sister has a similar situation, but she just doesn't complain. I do all the heavy lifting and I've broken my back a few times. Not to mention with all the stuff that's going on with America and Syria and... <sighs> Sometimes I bring China over and he helps me with my back. Oh, fuck me. And I have with his. China is very good. Very gentle yet firm. He has really helped me. I can recommend him for you if you want. Okay. While you guys respond, I'm going to tell the other me now. I'm not going to do the voice today. Also, Hedda does the voices. Because I forget my brother is upstairs. But yeah, while you guys decide this one, I am going to, um, uh... Uh, tell everyone on the Mino stuff. Am I official Mino? Yeah. I have so many notifications on the Amino, it's just dot 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 instead of the number of notifications that I have.
The curse of being popular. Alright, I'm back. Mm. Sorry, boyfriend, I can't talk to you today. Uh, I just does Rush even have a healthy ship? Oh, gosh, she's on fifty fifty. It is about 50 50 with this. Okay, we're gonna do the first one. Really? You would do that? Of course, you're my friend, Lithuania. Yeah, friend. I call him tomorrow. Thank you, that's very considerate of you, but. What? If you are insecure about your body, China has seen everything. And I mean everything. I thought he's seen a back like mine. I can tell you're really stressed out, Lithuania. I don't want to see my favorite friend get stressed out. Thank you, though I'm not sure if it's a good thing or a bad thing. Yes, and... Friend! Hi, friend! <laughs> I'm finally going back home. I had an unhealthy dose of Russia this week. This coffee isn't as good as I hoped. Coffee is coffee, though. Sometimes I wonder if it's even worth talking to Russia. I'm going to get dragged into something I don't want to be dragged into. Oh, believe me, last summer I was able to convince 40-plus people to ship Ruslet through via this game. Now I can do it with an official screen and sound and stuff. So no, I was just watching friends before I started the stream. Okay, uh, I really need to get to my gate. They started boarding already. Wait, I don't see anyone at my gate. Shit! Oh no! Oh no, the plane didn't take off yet, did it? No, sir, we still have another five minutes before the doors close. Thank God. Sorry I'm late. We get this all the time, sir. Don't worry. Thank you. Worried for nothing again. At least I don't have another stomachache. Gosh dang it, I keep getting scrolling down toggles of backlog. Cam can. What is Cam can? Cameroon in Canada? I literally took this background picture off of a flight that I attended myself. Let's relax. I finally need to get to have some time to myself on the flight home. Let's see. See, 23C. Ah, oh, there you are. Okay, so I got two separate sets of sprites for Russia, and I like them both so much, I decided to make one like an off screen sprite because I like them both so much. So, yeah. I was wondering when you would show up at the gate and never did. I was starting to worry. Yeah! Russia! But what are you doing at my plane? My plane! This is my flight. I need to get back to Moscow as soon as possible. And the earliest flight out to Moscow was not until evening. So this was the earliest connecting flight. And your seat is next to mine. What a coincidence! Yeah. Coincidence. Yeah, I love I love the artist. The artist is uh, um did a quite also did a crime scene for uh, Rust Vacation Roulette, and the, but it doesn't appear until chapter four, and I'm real, and because of that artist, I'm I am I'm really excited for chapter four to do chapter four because it's already sprung way ahead. I hope I don't ruin that, but yeah, um, yeah, I've been, had this like it was like one of the first crime scenes I was drawn. And then I, it was originally going to be for um, chapter two, and then I ended up moving it to chapter four. And so it's just like I just want to be like, no, I didn't forget about you. Yours is coming up. I just moved that scene to chapter four. I'm sorry. 
And anyways, also I don't have to be alone while I wait my impending punishment from my boss. Uh, gosh dang it, wrong button! Punishment? What happened if I may ask about it? Good day, passengers, and welcome to flight 213 to Vilnius. I am your captain, blah, 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 blah. Oh, this stuff is important. Oh, look, this stuff is important. Hey, <laughs> hey. He's avoiding the topic, but why? What did Russia do that was so bad? Russia accidentally Why me? He just had to fall asleep on me. The flight isn't even that long. Why is he really that tired? This is a public place. And he's getting incredibly cozy with me. This is so... Okay, is it awkward or is it cute? You tell me. <sighs> I know which one most of you are going to choose. I think I already know. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, Eng England is in the back room. England, what are you doing on this plane? What are you going? Why are you going to Vilnius? That you're making no sense. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay, most of you are screaming at me, cute. So I'm gonna go cute. I have to get out of this dead trap. Um, Russia. Russia, mm. Russia, wake up! You little schoolie, I don't want to marry you. Russia, we are landing in 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm sorry, but you were kind of drooling on me. Oh, I'm so sorry, how embarrassing. That's okay. Are we here yet? We're going to land soon. Uh, I see. What is he in trouble for? Why is he so nervous? Oh wow, it's a really pretty day today. The forecast says it's supposed to rain later. And it's October, so it's too ch chilly to go outside. What should I do today? We're going to check up on Latvia. Oh, I'll see what Latvia is up to. Hello, Latvia. I was wondering if you needed help throwing out all that rush. Help me! Eh? Please help me. Russia is threatened. Oh, hurry! Latvia! Latvia! I'm gonna turn the volume down. What is Russia doing to him now? Is it something horrific? I've got to help him. Who is knocking right now? Maybe it's Poland. Maybe he can be my backup. Surprise, bitch! It's Prussia! <laughs> you, what are you doing here? Ich bin hier, then. I don't speak German very well. I'm here to teach you the unawesome rule about video games. So it's going to have to wait. I have to save Latvia from Russia right now, so if you'll excuse me. Eh, yeah, Russia's got Latvia? Such a fat bastard. Hmm? As much as I hate Russia with every fiber of my being, we need to rescue Latvia. Get to my BMW. We're going to save the small boy with soft hair. <laughs> pew, pew. I didn't know Prussia cared about Latvia this much. To the awesome mobile. I forgot I put that line in there, damn it. Let's sit on this like a man. <laughs> there they are. He's tied up. Is Russia, is Russia, is he just feeding him biscuits? Russia, please, I can't eat anymore. I'm going to burst. It's nonsense. You are a growing boy, Latvia. You want to grow, yes? Y yes, but... Mm. One second. I need to make this seem realistic. Got some Japanese snacks from a Japanese market. But they melted and I am sad. Mm. If you want to grow big, you need to eat a lot, da? Okay, what's the plan? Hey, fat ass, stop that! Uh, he's so dead. Oh, Prussia, Lithuania, what are you doing here? 
What are you doing to Latvia? Hey, I'm just helping him grow big and strong so he can stop being so small, da? You better. Hmm, you're right, Lithuania. I'm sorry, Latvia. Those biscuits were good, but too many of them began to hurt my stomach. Speaking of stomachs, you're probably hungry, late Lithuania. I will make dinner for you. Oh, um, you really don't have to do that. I insist, I haven't had company in so long. You will join me, yes? Sure. Perfect. I don't have a car. I can't get home. I'll drive you home to the automobile. They ditched me. <laughs> a little more for us, right, Lithuania? Yeah. More for us. That is actually my dining room table at my old house. I miss my old house so much. Forgot how lovely the borscht was. That was good. I should cook borscht more often. Lithuania enjoyed it, that. Hashtag me too! <laughs> Save Latvia. Fat Fia. Jesus. Me too. <laughs> we're not to the me too part yet. Don't worry. We're not to the me too part yet. Shh. <laughs> I forgot how much I like borscht. The piroshkis were good too. It's just cooking is surprisingly good. <laughs> It makes me so happy to see that you're happy, Lithuania. It's actually a very nice thing to say. He probably doesn't get to cook for people that often. Well, this is a nice evening, but I should go home. Eh, yeah, okay then. That's just my old front door. Thank you for cooking for me. I have a lot of paperwork to finish. I understand. Let me just find... My keys. Shit, I forgot part to drop me here. Something wrong with Lithuania? I just realized Prussia drove me. Oh, it's okay, you could still catch the train. The train to Vilnius? Mm hmm. Leaves at 11 o'clock in the morning tomorrow. <laughs> morning? Mm hmm. I can just go to a hotel again. Yeah, I could go to a. What the hell? Something wrong? There is a blizzard outside in October. I guess winter is early this year. <sighs> it really makes me sad. Oh well. I guess you'll have to stay here now, Lithuania. No, 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 no. I'd rather stay outside than stay here. Okay, maybe not. That storm looks really bad. <laughs> I I feel better now. You're now that you're staying over, I am less bummed. I guess I could stay in my old room. Wait. They probably don't have much wood to warm up the whole house. They only have indoor heating in the west wing. Please don't tell me this means what I think it does. I guess you let us sleep with me, Lithuania. No! Hey, are you okay, Lithuania? You don't look well. It's nothing to just the stomach ache. Smart! <laughs> I just love you guys. Lizards are like a myth and a miracle from God. <laughs> he did it on purpose, I swear. <laughs> Ah, uh, but but not from the food, of course. It, it, it's just stress. Hmm. I think I let you left some of your pajamas here from last time. Who just rest here? I'll go look. How creepy! It's almost like you secretly knew I would tap this thing over. This blizzard almost seems planned. What am I thinking? Russia can't control weather. <laughs> oh, why do I have the sinking feeling that he does though? Because I can't text anyone to save me. I guess I just have to accept my fate. What do you know? I found Estonia's old pajamas. Just be grateful that you're not sleeping naked. 
probably sniff them jammies. Gosh dang it. Who would have thought that I would be end up back here again, frozen in fear like this? There's no way I'm going to be able to sleep tonight. Okay, I can escape. Yes, I just need to wait for him for to fall asleep, and then I can leave. You probably can't hear the sound effects, so. though. <laughs> His arm is around me! And now he's spooning me. Oh god, what do I do? What do we do? <laughs> and now he's gonna smash. <laughs> okay. Okay. Russia's now sweeping. Alright. Okay. 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 We're getting more things to stay. But so we're gonna stay. Maybe if I just stay still, he won't hurt me. What is that from the movie America showed me about the dinosaurs? <laughs> Even thinking about the miracle in this house is a crime. I'm shaking. I'm so scared. No, oh, I can't be scared of Russia anymore. Besides, I'm not his anymore. If he does something I don't like, I can leave. Maybe I'll end up snoring too loud and he'll kick me out. Yeah, Poland's always telling me that I snore really loud, so maybe. Let's see. Having a nightmare. I'm sweating profusely and breathing heavily. Should I wake him up? Trump and Putin are gay boyfriends. Way to ruin the moment. Let me smash. Oh gosh. Hmm. Let's see, I'm gonna wait for the delay to come and back and then... Mm. Oh. Okay, a lot of people are telling him to wait, me to wake him up, so I'll wake him up. Hey, Russia. Russia, Russia, wake up! Russia! Russia? It, it's okay, just catch your breath. I would get them water, but I know that the water is right here from the faucet. It's not safe to drink. Lithuania? Yes, it, it's me. I, I, I'm sorry I woke you up, but it looked like you were having a bad dream. I was. It was awful. Thank you for waking me. You get really awful dreams like that too sometimes. I know how bad they can be. It was about that year. Huh? It was that war. We were treading in the winter and had to stop for the night. But our tents were not prepared for the raging blizzard. It can be awfully annoying sometimes. Not being able to die. This was before I came out with the whole why Russia hates winter thing. And just freeze to death over and over again. And watch your mortal comrades slowly die one by one. You never know when they're going to take their last breath. You never know when their breathing is just going to stop. That's one of the scariest parts. You can see why he hates winter so much. That must have been awful. Hey, Lithuania. Hmm? What kind of bad dreams do you get? Um, I, I don't want to talk about it right now. It. Uh, may bring up bad memories. Confirm for smash. Smash. Gosh dang, with all you in the smash comment. <clears throat> True tin. Is Rosa <laughs> She kiss. Ah, oh, you're right. You're not cold, are you? No, I'm fine. You seem like you're shaking, nah? Oh, would you look at that? I'm really tired. I should go to sleep. You should too. You must be exhausted. Good night! Hmm. 
Good night, Lithuania. So he's doing that on purpose. So he's doing that on purpose. I'm so nervous. I'm actually having a guest over at my house today. The amount of sightseeing in my home is pathetic compared to theirs. Shit, in all my stress, I forgot who was coming over to sightsee. What did I invite over again? We invited Russia. He said, well, oh, I why I invited Russia over. What the hell was I thinking? Was I, what was I trying to accomplish? Oh, sure, let's show Russia all the pretty things in my country so he'll want to take it again. Stupid. Oh, wait, I think he invited himself over, like he usually does. Too late to cancel now. Lithuani. Ah! Ooh! Russia! You're wrong! Don't die! <laughs> Sorry, Lithuania. I forget they're such a small, fragile country sometimes. <laughs> so true. Yeah. So, what are you going to film this, da? Um, if you want to. I have never really gotten to stop and sight in Vilnius before. This will be fun. Yeah, fun. Well, here it is, Vilnius, my heart. Valentos Montvita's playing in the in the background with the radio. Hmm. Hmm. Are they going to smash? Uh, to fu okay, one of the routes they smash. <laughs> if traffic wasn't so awful, we could get to the heart. I've been here before. I never really toured it. So there is parliament. Ah, it's really cool. Really? Mm-hmm. I honestly think it's kind of ugly. It was designed in the Soviet days, and everyone knows all the Soviet buildings are ugly. So all the tourist stuff is in one place? Pretty much. Oi! Angry swearing in Lithuanian! <laughs> I never expected you to have such a colorful vocabulary, Lithuania. <sighs> this is what's great. This is what's great. It'll all be okay, it'll all be okay. What is it? Eh? What is what? That white building over there. It looks familiar. <laughs> um, it's really not important. Museum of Genocide Victims? Um, is it your Holocaust Museum? Yeah, yeah, it, it's my Holocaust Museum. I was going to pay my respects, but you seem really shaken up about it. Ah. <laughs> yeah. All right then. It's really, it's really a museum about the Soviet genocide, or they call it a genocide. Over there's a president's palace. Oh, you have one of those old-fashioned soldiers outside the palace? That's really cool. You think so? Mm-hmm. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's the Vilna River. Um, let's not go over there. Let's go over here. Eh? Why? Because someone really weird lives over the river and you really don't want to meet him. That's where the Lithuania's micronation is, actually. Okay, then. Ah, that palace. Palace? The palace of- oh, the palace of the Grand Dukes. Yeah, it's one of the prides of Vilnius. Thought be gone! Be gone! If it breathes, it's a thought, Jesus. Yeah, I'm one of the prides of illness. Oh, it's so nice, and it's intact. Not as intact as it used to be. No thanks to you! I never got to see the inside of that palace. Do you want to go in? Yes, I haven't seen the castles in centuries, I think. I'm not, it's not as pretty as my castles, but it's still really cool. I'm surprised he's so impressed by this stuff. I don't think it's all that special. I could resize some of these characters. I really should. 
I got to see where you and my sister lived. You treated her well. I'm so glad. Yeah, I had perfect memories. Where do you want to go to dinner? You heard good things about the TV tower restaurant. Plus, I bet the view was amazing, da? Lithuania? Oh, we can't go there. Eh, why not? It's a good tourist destination. I hear it's a good tourist destination. Lithuania? <laughs> oh, sorry, I it spaced out a bit. I'm really hungry. I'm really hungry. Let's get to the tower, da? There is nothing in that area. Here you can see the town. Lithuania, the more you tell me no, the more I want to go. <sighs> it can't be helped. Alright, let's go to the TV tower. We're here. I just need to park. Well, you really meant it when you said it was surrounded by nothing. Yeah. You should be able to see the city lights light up as we eat. It'll be so pretty. It is. And at Christmas time, we decorate it with lights. It's so much prettier. I bet. There was also this one point... This was also at one point the biggest basketball hoop in the world. Because praise basketball. <laughs> eh? Really? Eh? <laughs> I forgot how much you love basketball. I like hockey better though. Eh? What's that? What's what? That? So the pictures are so grainy here. Uh, but it was my first game, so eh. I am very thoughtfully challenged. I have a hard time being a... I, I, I don't wear makeup. So, it's be being a thought is hard for being a thought is hard for me to do. Uh, it looks like something from World War II. Lithuania, uh, I'm paying my respects. Hmm? Fourteen people died here. Oh, how oh, awful! I'll pay my respects too. This all happened because of you. Why are you paying your respects? No tragedy is hard to move on from Russia. Russia? This is it, isn't it? Hmm? Is this this is what you're going to court for? Yes. These people never really got justice today. No. That's how things are these days, isn't it? Things are unfair, da? Russia. Let's go eat now, come on. Russia, come on. I know you're hungry. Russia's been really hot since we saw the memorial. He even dragged me inside the museum where we, when we got to the tower. He's barely touching his food, and I know Russia loves- I know that Russia loves to eat. He's a big guy. Could it be? Does he? Could it be that he feels guilty? Russia, you're not eating much. Do you not like the food? The food is not the problem. And what? Say, Lithuania. Hmm. Sometimes it's hard to tell which is worse. Having no control over the damage you take, or having no control over the damage you cause. It really makes you think. The Russia. Lithuania, I have, I have an early birthday gift for you. But my birthday is two and a half months away. I no, mean, but okay, it's a Christmas gift. I really want to say this now. Russia, I'm going to bring those people you want to trial. Really? Yes, I, I understand now what happened. I, I want to make things up to you, and since you are my friend, after all. Mm. Trying to read some of the comments. It's just filled with thoughts. Why? Stop it. Stop filled with thought stuff. Thought puns. Stop it. Russia, you don't know how much that means to me. 
Thank you. Thank you so much. You have such an adorable smile, Lithuania. I wish you would smile like that more. Have I ever smiled like this around Russia? Then again, whenever I'm around Russia, I hear nothing but fear. But right now, I don't feel afraid. If I could get him to pay me reparations for the Vilnius Massacre, maybe he really has changed. But I was right. The is really is beautiful up here. It really is, isn't it? You can see so much from here. I originally thought this was going to be boring, but your capital is really cool, Lithuania. Really? Compared to Moscow, it really isn't anything special. I'm trying to read some of the comments. How many people are even in here? 54, holy crap. I see Moscow every day. This is nice and different. Really? How uh, weird. I'm, it's not even comparable to Moscow. Hey, Lithuania. Hmm? Thank you for showing me around. I really enjoyed the day. Oh, you're welcome. I'm getting to need a thought filter. Filter out every thought comment. My house is nothing special, so hearing that means a lot to me. <laughs> oh, wow. How cool someone is lighting off fireworks. Oh, it's like someone knows we're here. It is, isn't it? I'm going to filter out all the thought comments. I, I think I have something really important going on this week. I can't remember what it is. Uh, if it's really important, why can't I remember? Uh, what did I schedule last week? You scheduled a massage appointment with China. I almost forgot I have an appointment with China to set up for tomorrow. Or rather, the one Russia set up. Hold on one second. Uh, okay. Let's just get this over with. One second, I'm going to check the... Uh, Monetization status. I just want to make sure this is. Yep, this is monetized. We're good. Meep. No. Trippiness. All right. You are Lithuania, right? Yes, I am. Prepare for stupid stereotypical accents. All right. Are you ready for the amazing ancient Chinese technique I did? This is the part where you strip. Oh, sorry, I guess I'm just nervous. Trust me, no matter what you have, I see Wes Ada. I'm gonna wait for the comments because I know that you just yeah. And Russia is right next and Russia is right next door, so you can trust me. I imagine myself as a masseuse's nightmare. Just strip Ada. Oh, okay, I'm going. I'm sorry. Hmm, I haven't dealt with something like this in hundreds of years, Aro. I think I don't remember how. I'm waiting for the stripping comments. You've dealt with people like me before. Soldiers, mostly former a, form a prisoners of war. I can't- gosh dang it, stop scrolling down. I can use t technique that help him heal faster, Aro. Really? That would be very nice, thank you. No problem, now lay down, Ada. Okay. Uh, uh, oh my god, you are my sister's nightmare. You are so tense. I'm try not doing my full voice because my full voice gets really loud. So. And all the strip comments are now flooding in. <laughs> this is going to take a while. <laughs> I think he's rubbing too hard. So many knots, Aru. I think those are bones. Asha told me that you are insecure about your body, Aru. Eh, uh, I mean, uh, why would he say that? Well, aren't you? I mean, you are well to... 
You are a well-toned man who is in much better shape than me. I don't see why you're so insecure. I mostly don't want people asking about my back. Same with me, Aru. I have a scar on my back, too. Sympathy, I understand, but sometimes it's too much, Aru. Yeah, I know that feeling way too well. I kind of feel bad for people like Mr. Netherlands. He has a scar right on his face. I can only imagine how often he gets asked about it. You have siblings? No, I don't. Not anymore. Prussia killed them all. I have many. So, so many. Siblings, Hataru. You'll do nothing but raise them and they stab you in the back! Ah, China! Sorry about that, Aru. I hope I'm not too much of a burden. It's a little difficult, but I work around it, Aru. As long as I get paid, I'm happy. Oh, oh. That's about so, Aru? Mm -hmm. I'm not going to moan. I'm not going to moan so that loud. Stop it. No. Oh. If you're going to start moaning, Aru, I'm going to get air plugs. Uh, I'm sorry. Russia stalks you too, right? Oh, yeah, he stalks you as well. She, Aru, he does. Oh, I'm not the only one. He's been coming less lately, though. It it makes me happy, but at the same time I can't help. But at the same time I can't help but worry. And he's been coming over to my hu house less too, mostly because I have an army at my border now. You're in good shape. No wonder why Russia likes you. What? I said you're in good health. Russia likes me. N not in that way, right? Ah. Uh, uh, uh. Lenny faces. I see the Lenny faces in the comments. Oh, yeah, right there. I take that back. You have a lot of stress, don't you? Yes. I have a lot of stress problems. And I have a lot of health problems because of it. Like what? You can tell me. I am a doctor. Stomach aches, high blood pressure, high heart rate, polycurious, sometimes migraines, tense muscles, definitely. Yeah. Shaking. Yes. Insomnia? Sometimes. Sexual dysfunction? What? You can open up to me. Russia does all the time. So do we talk about our problems or, we, or do we ask what Russia talks about? I think we're going to ask what Russia talks about. He's been talking a lot about you lately. What? He says he's worried about you. Worried about me? Why? He says that every time he sees you, you're upset. And it concerns him, Aru. Of course. And it's upset because I see him. He is also worried that he scares you and that you don't think of him as a friend. I never used to, but now Russia and I have spent all this time together and... I don't know what to think. I mean, I know he's never going to change, but there's a part of me that wants to believe that he already has. Well, that isn't my decision. But what makes you think he's changed? Well, I've seen it in him. He's going to give me reparations for war crimes he never wanted to confess. He shows sympathy towards my problems. It's like, yeah, he's never treated me this nicely before. Hmm, that doesn't sound too unusual, Otto. Hmm? Russia has become one of my close friends. He was there for me in a lot of hard times. We often go out drinking and he consoles me whenever I have family troubles and... He actually... He's actually not too creepy once you get to know him, Otto. I know you... I don't know him how you know him, though. I know I can't forgive him and that I shouldn't, but part of me wants to. After spending time with him recently, I've actually been enjoying myself, but part of me is telling me I'll end up... Part of me is telling me I'll to stay away because I'll end up where I was 30 years ago. I'm just nervous I'm going to fall under his rule again. But you aren't being forced to spend time with him, right? No, no, I'm not. You're right. I can choose to spend rush time with Russia if I want to, and I can choose to leave him if I want. Maybe that's why last time made me so miserable. Perhaps now he sees you as an equal rather than a servant, Aru. This person gay. Yeah, maybe. I don't know, I still feel like worried. I'm trying to look back and forth from the comments. I probably shouldn't do that. Oh, good night, people. 
What would it take for you to accept Brush as a friend, Otto? An apology and an explanation. Otto? I spent most of my life on somebody's leash, whether it was Poland's or Germany's or Prussia's or Russia's. I've had a lot of bad things happen to me, but what I never got was an apology. No apology for the Nazis, no apologies for taking Vilnius, no apology for the Crusades, and no apology from Russia for anything. A simple apology would mean the world to me. I'm just going to try not to look at the chat. It, it, you're right, it is really confusing. I'm, I'm just not going to look at the chat right now because I don't even know what the hell's going on. Normally it would be enough for me to forgive him, but... Russia, it's going to take one hell of a pop an explanation to, under to get me to understand why he did what he did. Maybe one day that will happen. Maybe it will. Whether I can forgive him or not is another story. Ah, huh, Christmas is coming up. In, uh, in July. And for once, I don't have to work. This is going to be a great year. But then what do I do? I haven't really made any plans. What should I do for Christmas this year? We are going to stay home. I think I'll enjoy a nice Christmas by myself. Just me and the dog. Head Cannon Lithuania has a dog. Because he just seems like a dog person. I haven't been able to give Roma much attention lately. I've only been able to let him out and give him basic needs. I'm going to start with a nice fire in the fireplace. Who is calling me? And why is their number blocked? Laurinaitis? Lithuania? Russia? Lithuania, I need help. Could you come over as soon as you can? What? What happened? I was walking down the stairs in my basement and I apparently slipped and I fell and I... Oh... Would you, I would call an ambulance, but I'm trapped under this stuff. Ow! Also, they wouldn't understand that I'm... Can you please hurry? I'll be there as soon as I can. Thank you. Hang in there. Russia? Russia! He said he was in the basement. I remember the basement is here. Russia! Oh. Russia! Don't worry, I'm coming. I can be taken more than one way. I'm joking. Whoa, all this furniture. This is literally all fucking photoshopped. It can't be. Russia? Lithuania. Russia? I hear you, but I don't see you. I'm under all this furniture. I can barely move. You're under all that? Can you please call an ambulance? I can't reach my phone anymore. Of course, I I'll try to help you out. The emergency number is 103 for an ambulance. Oh, not being able to die from this is a real pain. I got it, but while we wait, I'm going to dig you out from under all that stuff. C can you lift it? It doesn't look too heavy piece by piece. Let's see, it looks like he's under the grandfather clock, then the coffin, then I need to clean the pipes, then the couch and the mattress, then the filing cabinet, and finally the wardrobe. Seems like a good idea. Should be crushed, but it's Russia. Hello? Yes, I need an ambulance at the Kremlin as soon as possible. I know it's close at this hour, but the person that needs help is Ivan Braginsky. Yes, thank you. Just knock on the door and I will let you in and show you the basement. Tulis uh, Laurinaitis. I'm the nation of Lithuania. All right, thank you. G goodbye. It should be here soon. All right, what do I lift first? Basically, it's a memory thing where you have to memorize on what you need to lift first, so... To make this faster, I'm just going to just go. Just this thing alone to kill a human. <sighs> Alright, what's next? Oh fuck, I forget. Uh, the coffin, I think? Why does Russia even have a- Why am I even asking myself that question? It's Russia, of course he would have a spare coffin lying around. 
It was light, so I can assume it's empty, thank god. Alright, what next? I think it's the pipes. That was easy. What next? Uh, da, 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 couch? How the hell did he manage to survive for all the stuff falling on him? He's a nation, but still! <laughs> it looks like I'm narrowing it down. I think the mattress is next. I don't know, I haven't played this in like forever, so... What do you mean? Everyone has a break. <laughs> this is a light compared to the couch. What now? Uh, the cabinet. Oh, Divya, if I could just slide this up. You all, you are okay? <sighs> yes, I'm almost done. <sighs> oh no, the sex dungeon's only part of his basement. <laughs> oh damn, this is going to be really heavy. I can do this. I can do this. One more and he's out. Aha! Lithuania is very strong. Thank you so much. Ow! Don't try to walk. Your back is probably in really bad shape. Your arm looks pretty bad too. Oh, my body hurts. I can imagine. That probably would have killed a human. Oh, that's probably the medics. I'll go let them in. Please hurry. The wardrobe you must have protected him from a lot of this from the rest of the stuff because it's mostly his arm and his back. Really? Your friend is pretty lucky. Oh believe me, he's more than lucky. Then again, his medical records show a frequent history of breaking his back. Eh? Apparently he has severed his he has severely injured his back six times. Eh? Ten years ago he broke his back from falling off a roof. Ten years ago. Forward shows a crack in his spine from a really power blow from some kind of fight. I had nothing to do with that, I swear. They slipped on ice, hit, hit by a tank, jumping out of a plane without a parachute, hit by a truck. I always thought Russia was cursed, but... Wow, I actually remember a few of those. He's still a little loopy from the painkillers, but you can go in. You should be able to talk to him. Maybe tell him that I'm not Alexander Lukashenko. <laughs> I will do, sir. Hey, Russia's all high on drugs. I don't need I don't need life. I'm high on drugs. <laughs> Russia? Hmm? Lithuania. <laughs> There's two Lithuanias. Still on a bit of those drugs. Yep, it feels nice. How are you feeling? Tired and a bit fallen back. <laughs> the drugs making you tired? Yeah. Hey, Lithuania. Hmm? Thank you. If you hadn't been there, I would be. You are a true friend. Oh gosh, which one do we do? I'm just gonna wait for you guys to catch this up. Because I know this live stream is behind quite a lot, so... Black Skelly Tape can even fix Belarus's feeling. I don't need drugs, I'm high in my own brain cells. Why did Russia jump? I'll have what Russia's having. I think he got into some of China's opium. <laughs> uh. Oh boy. <laughs> Okay. I say, except you're welcome. <laughs> okay, I'm just we're just gonna say, what are friends for? You can always rely on your friends for help, Russia. I was setting up for the Christmas gathering I was planning on having. Oh yeah, that invitation I threw out. Classic Lithuania, classic. I don't even know why I'm bothered if no one is coming. Everyone is either busy on my Christmas or planning to go to America's party the day before. 
So it looks like I'll be all alone on Christmas again. All right. This is the, um, this decides the ending you get. So I'm just going to save here and then wait for you guys to pick a, um, an option. All right. But, yeah. <laughs> the Moana reference. All right. Flex tape can fix Rush's back. <laughs> no, only duct tape can do that. Uh, okay. McLeave. <laughs> <laughs> okay, everyone's telling us and us to stop it, Lenny faces. Lenny faces. No, I know what you mean. That that's not that kind of come. Okay, now I made it dirty. Really? I know how it feels to be alone like that. Besides, you need someone to look after you after all the bones you've broken. They'll heal fast, though. Still, I'm not sure if I trust you all alone in your state. Besides, I didn't have any plans anyways. Lithuania? Hmm? Thank you. Whoever thought I'd be going to Russia's house for Christmas? I guess the people really can change, and that includes me. How gay is each ending? <laughs> Should I just go in? Rush is probably lying in bed due to his back. <sighs> Why do I keep agreeing to see Russia when I've rejected numerous him numerous times in the past? Why do I keep coming back? Do I just pity him that strongly? You can't fix everything, Talise. And you will certainly can't fix Russia. Russia is far beyond being repaired. You know that. Why am I okay with this? Why do I want to come here? Maybe it's because I'm actually getting something in return? Or it's because I'm in control? Last time I was forced against my will to do whatever Russia wanted. Now if I leave, Russia can't do anything about it. If Russia is that desperate to keep me as a friend, I have Russia in my hand now. And I guess I kind of like it. That, that sounds sadistic, doesn't it? But... I'm not going to do this to Russia. Russia's, I'm not doing this to Russia. Russia's doing it to himself. He's so desperate for friends. And knowing Russia's past, I can't help but feel sympathy. The weak Russia. God, fuck you all. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Uh, a pity Russia. Pity. That's what I feel. I like taking care of people. I like it when people really rely on me. I never had siblings, but everyone being under my roof during the Commonwealth, I was so happy. Maybe just seeing Russia rely on me like this again, instead of me relying on Russia, makes me feel like I'm a leader again. Could it be that... Hello, Lithuania. Uh, greetings, Russia. Happy belated birthday. Who would have thought I'd be happy to see Russia? Thank you, Lithuania. I enjoy the shovel you gave me. It's nice, really great for digging ditches. <laughs> I forgot I put the line in there. <laughs> Come on in, it's cold out. Lithuania, shouldn't be. Russia, shouldn't you be resting? Resting it. I feel fine. Even though you feel fine, I don't know if it's a good idea to be walking around. Something smells disturbingly delicious. Ah, the owner should be ready now. Dinner? Mm-hmm. The board should be just about finished. Oh, wow. Candlelight? How traditional. Do you remember the Christmas traditions, Lithuania? Um, kind of. I am older than you, da? Yes, I, I believe so. Dear God, please bless the line, the bread, the... Gosh dang it, the music stopped working. Gosh dang it. Dear God, please bless, bless the wine, the, the bread, the food, and the vodka. Of course, the fucking vodka. And thank you for keeping us alive this year. Amen. First, we start with the kutya. Russia, where are your sisters? 
I'm surprised Belarus isn't even here. Oh, yeah. Well, you know my deal with Ukraine right now. And Belarus, we recently got in a fight. I think they're both at America's party right now. Do they even know you that you broke your back? No. Then why is there an extra plate? Ah, you forget. You have to set an extra plate for Jesus. Oh, yeah. Lithuania um, officially became a country in like 12, 1236. He's pretty young. Russian traditions. Since we only have two people, I don't, and I don't know how religious you are, I'll keep the prayer short. Dear God, thank you for keeping us alive this year, and thank you for the wonderful food and vodka, and most of all, thank you for the wonderful friends I made this year and the great times I spent with them, or just the one person, because I don't have many friends still. But I thank you most of all for Lithuania, even though my family is torn apart, and even though I'm still a very lonely man, and even though I will never feel welcome anywhere I go, you gave me a friend to keep me company this year, and that is a wonderful blessing. Amen. Amen. Uh, the, what, Russia and Lithuania's fight is in another route. Oh, the smoke on the candle is straight. That means it's a blessing for the new year. Well, let's eat. I have piroshki, zikra, borscht, zaman, and espig, and Brussels sprouts, and kisel. Oh, uh, of course, plenty of fast to go around. Thank you. Oh, I almost forgot the potato pancakes. P potato pancakes. Mm hmm. I know how much you love them, so I made them especially for you. I do love potato pancakes. I went overboard on them last Christmas, but I can't help it. My one weakness potato pancakes. <laughs> I always end up eating so many that I get a stomachache. I need to watch myself. Silence. I'm trying. What even is the chat right now? The food is really good, especially these potato pancakes. Has Russia taken any? Did I seriously only leave one for him? How rude of me! Wait, he's barely eating. Is something on his mind? Oh wow, that borscht went quick. I shouldn't eat my food so fast, but I can't help it. I feel so nervous for some reason. Eat the Latvians of the- What? No, we are not going to consume the Latvians! This chat is a sin. You all, you all need Russian Jesus. Why do I feel so nervous? I don't feel afraid, but I feel nervous like I want to impress him? Yeah, why would I want to do that? Why would I care about Russia what Russia thinks about me? I shouldn't. But why do I do though? Would it be because... No, no, pull yourself together, Lithuania. That's a bad idea. That's a really bad idea. Hey, Lithuania? Hmm? You're eating really fast. Are you okay? And you're hardly eating. Who are you to talk? <laughs> Ah, I'm so sorry how rude of me. <laughs> I'm just glad you love my food so much. But I'm worried. I know how you get stomachache when you eat too much too fast. Same, Lithuania, same. Ah, uh, yes, thank you, Russia. I don't know what I was thinking. I seriously don't. Me and Russia? Like that? How did the thought even cross my mind? Do I... Do I really care that much about him? Do I keep coming back to him because I have romantic feelings for him? Victims love their abusers too. This is a bad idea, bad idea. I thought this over before. Then last time I thought about that horrible, horrible things happened to me. Why are these feelings coming back? Why? Lithuania? Potato pancakes are great! Wow. Smooth. Lithuania, I need to talk to you about something. Um, okay. Yeah, let's talk. I need to tell you something. A anything. I'm sorry. Hmm? Pardon, what, 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 what was that? I'm sorry. I know you don't get many apologies. So for Christmas, I'm giving you an apology and an explanation. 
that's what you wanted, huh? Oh, you thought he was gonna confess his feelings, didn't you? Ha ha, fuck you. <laughs> I'm sorry if I did something that wasn't okay with you. Russia, I, I don't know what to... How did you... You may be an introvert, but I have my way of... Still have my way of knowing things. That, that really means a lot to me. Thank you. Lithuania? Yeah? Why didn't you tell me? What? what? Why didn't you tell me that you weren't okay? Why didn't you tell me that I hurt you? Oh, um, I guess I just thought you already knew and didn't care. After all, I was a servant. I wasn't supposed to complain. That's just how it works. Were you really that scared of me? If I knew what happened, I would have stopped drinking like that. I guess I really don't know how to get pe how to get people like me, get people to like me, even after all these years. I'm trying to read. The I'm gonna read the comments. Yep. I guess growing up alone doesn't help me with other people. Russia. Do we, for I don't know, uh, do we forgive him? Do we forgive him? Hmm. Half of this chat is reacting, the other half is just posting memes. <laughs> do we forgive him or do we not forgive him yet? Okay, people are telling me to forgive him. I'll forgive him. I forgive you. What was that? I said I forgive you. Really? I do. That's all I wanted to hear from you. Thank you. Would have thought I would ever forgive him. I feel like a huge weight has been lifted from me. That was a good meal. Yeah, it was. Why am I expecting something to happen? It's not like I want Russia to do that with me. No way, no way. Ho ho ho! I'm, I'm I'm awaiting the Lenny faces in the comments. Why do I? <laughs> oh God! Why now? This is not appropriate. Normally my sister makes gingerbread, but she's not she's not here this year. Yeah, let's get a boner. That's what that was. And I forgot the dessert. That's okay, I actually brought one. Eh? Really? Yes, I made a homemade chocolates. Ooh. Nah. A chocolates is normally already reserved for special occasions like weddings and Christmas, but I guess it's close enough to Christmas. The crying Lenny faces. <laughs> they say a chocolates is also a symbol of love. Oh, Lithuania, you sly motherfucker. A symbol of love. Y yes. Lithuania, I need to tell you something. Do we tell him first or do we let him tell, tell us? Uh, I, I'm trying to, like, oh, communist lemon. <laughs> I guess that's very fitting. Lithuania is- oh, fuck you! That's brilliant, but fuck you. <laughs> 
Russia first. <laughs> oh boy, I'm getting about 50-50. Mm, oh boy. Okay, I'm gonna- more people are- Oh gosh, it's about 50-50. Uh, it's, it's getting about 50-50. I don't know, person who flipped co coins. Okay, now it's- people are saying Russia, so I'm just gonna leave Russia. I know I should have said this a long time ago, but by over time I developed these. Oh, I have feelings for you. I I don't know how to put this. I had a feeling this was how you would react. You have a weird look on your face. I know people are scared of me for some reason, but I understand. It's always ways meant to be alone. I have been on my life. Russia. I probably ruined everything. I'm sorry. Russia, wait. Hmm? You didn't ask me how I felt. You say a shakotis is a symbol of love, right? Lithuania. Do you? I do. I'm just so happy. This is one of the best Christmases I've ever had. Even though your Christmas already passed. You also deserve to have a better birthday present than just a shovel, I guess. Wait, that was my birthday gift? What am I getting for Christmas? <laughs> <gasps> you are a dirty Lithuania, that on a holy day! It's just an ordinary day for pagans. <laughs> you are adorable, Lithuania. Banned in Russia for being too gay. I, I fucking love you. Gosh dang it. Ah, I forgot to make Russia leave from the screen. And that is copyright, so uh, yeah. That is copyright, so I can't show that to you. Oh gosh, do I do one more route? Do I do one more route? Or do I just do um the some other Russia endings? I'm trying to read catch up on the comments while you guys decide. Russia is big gay. Cries in the gay corner. Banned in Russia for being too gay. Take him to the sex dungeon. <laughs> this is a very white Christmas. Fuck you. Fuck you. You're brilliant, but fuck you. <laughs> oh, there's Kat. Russia lost to Croatia. Don't remind him. Mm. Other routes. Uh, mm -hmm. We need more gay. Do Belarus or Estonia? Uh, mm. Yeah, change the fright scene between Prussia and Lithuania, so. Yeah, the last part is Donnie, so yeah. People want me to do a new route, so I'm going to do that. Um, okay, so... <sighs> I'm going to go click in the corner and fast forward the thing.
This time, since half and half um, requested stuff, I'm going to kick the doors down this in like uh, next this time. But hold on one second. Uh, since I never made Russia leave the fucking scene. Uh, even though I'm probably not going to upload another one, but yeah, Russia, you need to leave. You need to go that leave the scene because so the credits can roll. Anyways. I'm going to kick the doors in. Sorry I'm late. Okay. Only half the nations are here. What is going on? Haha, uh -huh, OMG, you should totally see your face. It is as a funny laugh I'm not going to do. Then this is the same stuff. Uh, blah 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 blah. You guys are going to decide. I'm going to get some more water. Don't talk to yourself, Ian. You're so cute. I bet I can't show you to the camera because the camera is shit. <laughs> oh. It's also probably changed into my pajamas. Oh. All right, what route are we going to go through today? Okay. Okay. I just mostly just see America is flooding thing, everything, so. Okay, we'll do, we'll, okay, fine, we'll do America. Okay, we'll do America. Okay, okay, okay. We'll do America. Dude, you look dehydrated. Have a Gatorade trademark. Um, do you have any water? Obey your thirst! Oh, okay, okay. Thank you. No problem, bro. Say, you have a Gatorade in your- You have Gatorade in your house, right? Yes, America. My country distributes Gatorade. Awesome, bro. So, how has your life been going? It's been going pretty good, better than it was before. But she still makes me nervous, though he still stalks me, and he keeps asking me to come to a Soviet reunion. And there's a whole smoky gap, and Kaliningrad is stalking up with nukes, and... Dude, chill. If you ever need reinforcements, just call me and I'll save you. Hold on a second. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, cat just kitten distraction. Yeah, really? But you already have armies guarding my borders. I don't want to be a burden. It's no problem. I'm the hero after all. Besides, England and I are already sending troops to the Savalki Gap. Yeah, I suppose. Thank you. Not a problem. You're a pal, Lithuania. <laughs> Dude, it's okay. Just a pat on the back. Uh, yeah. I don't remember you being so jumpy. What's wrong, dude? Um, we are going to start the meeting. Everyone to your seats. Aw, oh, man. Dude, you should, you should you should totally go for grub with me later. Grub? Dinner, man. Food. Oh, yeah, that sounds great. Uh, if I don't have so much paperwork. Great. See you there, man. Uh, the meeting is over. What do I do now? We're going to eat with America. I talked about dinner earlier. I think I should catch with food, some food with him. I don't remember doing this, so 
transition. Hmm, he told me to meet me here. Maybe he's running late. I'll go call him. It's unusual of him to be late. Lithuania, yo, get in the car! Uh, America? Where did you get a Mercedes? Prussia lent it to me. Get in, we're getting hamburgers in, in Hamburg. That's how Americans pronounce it. Americans pronounce it. Hamburg. It's Hamburg. It's Hamburg. You never fail to amuse me. Prussia told me about this awesome hamburger place. This will be so cool. Now I can finally say I eat a hamburger in Hamburg. Are we going to eat Frankfurters in Frankfurt next? Haha, <laughs> good one. Even though I have a weak stomach, hamburgers surprisingly don't make me sick. Only when it's really greasy. Get in, losers, we're going shopping, yes! So, dude, now that we don't have Germany to cut us off, how's it going? Things are better than they used to be. How's the election? Meh. This came out in 2016, by the way. Or whatever, in 2017. Meh, either way it would have been weird. I'm grateful for the iron woman. That's what Lithuania calls his president. Anyways, all right, my com economy is getting better. England is still taking all of my workers, but I'm on the euro now. And my suicide rate is going down. I think I'm down to number four in the world. Actually, he's back up to number two. Sorry, Lithuania. That's kind of depressing, man. It used to be number one three years ago. Thank good for you! He was number one! No, not, 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 that's a bad thing to be number one in. <laughs> Living on my own for a long time has been nice. But it would be nicer if I wasn't always so sick in the economic crisis, but I only feel it when I bend over. Even Russia is backing up from, backing off from me. That's really good to hear. Last time I, we really had to talk, you weren't doing so well. When was that again? It was 2014. You called me up panicking, saying he was after me again. He's after me again. I just know it. Yeah, 2014 was not a good year for me. Speak of the devil, how is he? How do you think? He drops by every time he goes to Kaliningrad. He always drives 15 hours out of his way just to drive through me, and I know he does it on purpose. I think he stops talking me after Crimea. That's something. Probably because of the guns. I told you guns would work. Wow, every street name sounds like a beer name in Germany. Your country has a lot of Germanic roots. I'm not surprised that you have a lot of German named beers. Ah, this is the place! Crusher was right, that was good. Not as good as my place, but the best burger I've had in Germany. I haven't been to your place in a while. I've dropped by for your visit, for your birthday, and for meetings. But I haven't stayed for your house in a long time. Dude, you've got to come over next week! I'll see, I mean, if I'm not too busy. Tony and the Whale totally miss you, man! It's been almost ten years since since you saw them! <laughs> I guess I'll have to drop by then. Come to think of it, I've never been to your house before. Oh, my house isn't anything special. No, man, I want to see your house! You were... You're at my house for a decade. I've got to visit you at least once. There really isn't much sightseeing unless you have churches, not like churches and Nazi and Soviet history. Dude, I was watching the show the other day and I saw that your house, at your house, there's a house made out of frying pans. Mm hmm. I've not heard much about that. But you've got to come over to my place next week. I'll see about that. I would love to go if I can. I'm finally going to be back home. I've had an unhealthy dose of Russia this week. This coffee isn't as good as I hoped. Sometimes I wonder if it's even worth talking to Russia. Oh, but I got to see, get to see, got to see America this week. That was so nice. Uh, it would be nice to visit him again. Lit. 
Eh, hey, America? Hey, Lithuania, when's the flight? Not for a few hours, you. Same. Hey, have you gotten lunch yet? Not yet. Want to grab a bite with me? We're going to grab a bite with you because... Because we want to suck your dick. I can go for some food. Great, let's find a place. Uh, these sausages are really good. Hell yeah, they are. This pretty much trumps the one in Chicago. I have never been there. Really, I should take you there sometime. I'm surprised Poland hasn't taken you there. It's the second highest Polish population in the world. Really? I guess that's what he meant when he said he made Warsaw, Warsaw your capital. I'm not sure if he knows that Chicago isn't the capital of the United States. Right, Lithuania. Oh, kinky! Ha ha ha! On that note, I, I should have you over again. I'm not doing anything important next week. Eh? Really? Totally! Tony and the whale totally miss you, man! Tony... We, we could go to Chicago, or maybe even Area 51 if you want to. Air, apparently, in the, in the comics, America is apparently obsessed with Area 51. Uh, that's just something that Hema did, so... No, San Francisco is a really shit city. I know, my boyfriend lives there. Or lives around there. Oh, that sounds really... Whoa, sick, some kid just threw up! Man, that is nasty! Huh? Dude, are you okay? You don't look so good. I have a weak stomach. Do you want to get out of here? That would be preferred, yes. Alright, let's split. I don't want you throwing up, too. I just seen a road. San Francisco is the best city. Um, New York is the best city. Chicago is the best city. <laughs> All the roads. Oh wow, it's really pretty day today. But the forecast said it's supposed to rain later. What do I do? We go call America. America asked me to call him to speak. I should do that. Hello, America. You wanted me to call you. Come over this week? I, I would love to. That would be great. I'll see you at your house. I'm so excited. America's house. Ripped straight from the anime. I haven't been here in so long. I love living here. I kind of wish I still did. Fucking. Tony! Fucking! I missed you too, Tony! Oh? Uh, Mr. Whale, I missed you too! Hey, man! This is actually um, uh, from the official Hetalia soundtrack. That's why- th that's what the music is from. The official- um, this, uh, the official uh, soundtrack. I cannot speak today, it's getting late. <sighs> America! So glad you can make it over, man! I have so many things I want to do! But I see that Tony and the Whale have missed you. Do you want to hang out with them or do you want to play a little one-on-one -on -one with me in basketball? Oh boy, both sounds so tempting. Okay, you guys decide what you're gonna, what you're gonna do. I'm going to get my pajamas on. Because it's almost midnight.
Elisha. What are we doing? Okay, I'm getting a mix. Okay. I'm getting a mix so far. Okay, I'm getting an overwhelming um, majority for basketball. So we're gonna... Oh, gosh dang it. We're gonna play with balls today. Alright, man, let's see if you still got it. You beat me last time, but this time I'm ready. Because basketball is sick and religion in Lithuania. And he scores! Ah! Oh. Ha 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 ha! I still got it. I haven't had much practice lately. But it was a close game. You had a huge lead over me. I guess you got cocky. <laughs> Maybe I did. Break his ankle. <laughs> Gosh dang it. So what do you want to do now? I had this awesome movie that I've been waiting to watch. Sounds great. Oh, gosh dang it. I could use a wrist step for that. Awesome, Tony and the Whale can watch the movie with us. I have this horror movie called Night in Werewolf Woods. Sounds fun. Let's watch it then. Silence. Well, that was a heart racing movie. And the rather gory one. Lloyd is gonna get his ass pat I mean handed to him. Uh you you are all perverts. You you all need American Jesus. You all need Mormonism, that's what you need. Lenny faces. Fuck you. <laughs> sorry about that, man. I sorry about that, man. I hope your stomach is okay. It's fine. I'm surprised. I only threw up once. Anyways, it's midnight. We should get ready for bed. Yeah, midnight. That's when the werewolves come out and tear you to shreds. Well, good night to me, America. Wait! I can't sleep after watching that. C can you stay in my bed tonight, please? Okay, I know what the- I'm pretty sure I know what the answer is going to be. But I'm just going to wait a little while anyways. <sighs> yes, getting laid. Okay, I think that it's going to be an overwhelming yes. So we're just going to say, I don't mind at all. Thanks, man. It's no problem. I'm honestly a little freaked out, though. And it's not like I haven't slept in your bed before. Thank you for staying with me, man. Again, America, it's no problem. I just feel safer with you here and stuff. <laughs> I don't know what I can protect America from that he can't handle himself, though. Take his capital. Oh my gosh. <laughs> With all the bathroom with all the bathroom breaks you took, it really made the movie seem a lot less real. Uh, that's part of getting old and having stress problems. Oh wait, you won't get that because you're the powerhouse of the world. Forgot about that. Shut up and sleep with me. Come on, why don't you sleep? Okay. Hey America. Yeah? I really miss this place. Again, thank you for inviting me. Dude, I missed you! Thanks for coming! Well, good night, America. Good night, bro. You miss me? I don't get it. There's nothing special about me. Why would he be happy to have me around? Oh, America, I made you coffee. You didn't have to do that. You don't work for me anymore. I know. But thanks, man. Hey, I have some bad news. Hmm? What is it? Sorry, dude. Have to run a couple of- have a couple errands to run that kind of disrupts my day. 
Oh, it's no problem. Don't worry about it. I'll come with you. Eh, really? Yeah, it'll go quite faster then. But after all my errands here, I have to go all the way to Chicago to pick up something. That's a long ways away. Not to mention the train is always delayed. Tony could get us there faster, and you've always wanted me to show me Chicago, and now we can finally go there. Dude, that's a great idea! Why didn't I think of that? Hey, Tony, do you think you could take us to Chicago? Fucking! Let's go, bro! You're making good time, America. It's only 11.09. Great, bro! Eh, America? Oh, there's one thing I want to do before we hit Chicago. I said it half Russian, half te stereotypical American. All right. This man died in the 18th century. Is he a, an important historical figure? Should I say something? I don't know who this is, but if America is grieving. I'm just gonna go for the first option I see. So I'm just oh hey Kazajiro. <laughs> oh, I love watching all your reactions. I had to have at least one sad thing. Just an old friend. Thought just thought I'd say hi. All right, were you close? Kind of, as kids we were. I'm just making everybody sad, and I love it. I see. He was a human, right? Yeah, he didn't understand. Neither did I at the moment, but that's just something people like us have to deal with, live with. Yeah. Come on, enough depressing stuff. Let's go to Chicago! Oh, fucking course it's Davy. Why wouldn't it be Davy? We're here! We are here! Oh, whoa. There's so many things to do here. What do you want to do? Where do you want to go? There's Navy Pier, Millennium Park, Shed Aquarium, Wrigley Field, the Sears Tower, Chinatown. Though I recommend you maybe don't go there. China's kind of a dick. Where are we now? Grant Park. This is Buckingham Fountain. Over there is Lake Michigan. Oh, I don't know much about Chicago at all. I think it would be best if you lead. All right, let's see. The aquarium takes up a huge part of the day, and it's not baseball season, so Wrigley Field is out. Oh, I know where to start! Eh, what is this? Millennium Park! And what is that thing? Oh, we have an Ohio person in the comments. I go to Michigan. It's the bean! Oh, does it have any historical significance? Haha, <laughs> nope! <laughs> oh man, we almost forgot about lunch! Oh, yeah. There's a stand selling sausages over there. I'll go get a couple, or, or as they say there, sausages. Okay. I don't understand. Why a bean? What does it mean? I will never understand modern art. Defend the Michigan. Those sausages were good. I can taste the Germanic heritage here. So this was the tallest building in the world at one point? Yep. 
Wow. <laughs> Dude, you gotta come over here. I gotta show you something. What? What? There's there's this glass box where you can stand over where it looks like there's no floor. Wanna try it? <laughs> no thanks. Come on, bro, it won't break. I don't know, but stuff like that really freaks me out. If you want, I'll hold your hand the whole time. Come on. Uh, hey, no, no need to drag me. I can walk myself. This is really freaky. I feel incredibly nervous just standing here. It's okay, bro. I got you. Having contact with him, it makes me feel a lot better. You're holding me. This is actually pretty cool. Okay, now smile. I guess it really wasn't anything to be afraid of. Actually, I just went to Navy Pier this weekend. There really is, like, nothing to do there. Hold hands, yep. So, you scared of heights or no? I'm not scared of heights, but stepping on glass is a little freaky. I used to be like that, too. But then Japan introduced me to this thing in Tokyo Tower, and I thought it was so cool I just had to have the same the Wells Tower. The Sears Tower. So, how is the basketball here? Oh, yeah, you're a basketball guy. Well, Chicago is known for the basketball, baseball and basketball. Their mascot is the Bulls. They had this legend, Michael Jordan. Now they're pretty decent, but I, I bet on them quite a bit. Sounds like it'll be fun to go to. Actually, I was supposed to go to a game with a Congress member today, but he bailed on me. I put the tickets on StubHub, but no takers. Uh, really? Wanna go? You really need to ask me that. Praise basketball! Wow, basketball's amazing to watch here. Woo! Haha, <laughs> yeah. It's not as popular as football, baseball, or car racing, but college basketball is what really gets people excited. Really? Yeah, people have this whole betting system where we dedicate a whole month to it. We call it March Madness. Oh, um, I once turned my TV tower into a basketball hoop during FIBA. I set the record for the largest basketball hoop in the world, actually. Dude, that sounds so awesome! We just really love basketball. I knew you were going to start chipping Lithuaniacs basketball. I freaking knew it. Basketball is love, I say. Basketball is life. Oh gosh, dang it, I scrolled too fast. Oh, what's this river called? Uh, the Chicago River? Oh, right. Over there is the Trump Tower. Not nearly as nice as the one in New York, though. Then again, I'm more of a New York person. Each day really does have its own culture. Not that I'm used to it. all the hands would have eaten today. That in the pizza that's cut into squares. Yeah, I like the triangle pizza better. I don't know what they were thinking. The deep dish is good. The one thing I actually use silverware for. It really is interesting. The toppings are at the bottom. Fascination with that makes me laugh. Did you know on St. Patrick's Day we dyed this river green? We did that with the Vilna River last year. Eh, small world. You can't lie, comments, why? We had a lot of fun this week, America. Thank you for inviting me. No problem, man. No problem, man. Always like having you over. But next time, I'm coming over. All right, but it's not going to be. It's going to be nowhere near as interesting. I'm sure that's not true. I miss him a lot. I should invite him over next week. I miss times like this. I'm so nervous he's gonna have a guest over, sightseeing, planning. Who did I invite over? We invited America over. I still can't believe America is coming over. I can't believe he wanted to come to my house. Nothing compared to his. I just need to finish cleaning the kit. This is what I have to do. 
Hello, America. Sup, man? I'm so pumped to see your place. There's so many things I want to show you, I don't know where to start. Whatever you think is best, man. Okay, do we go to Vilnius or do we go on a road trip? This is a, this doesn't decide the ending, but it decides on what kind of events are going to happen, so. Oh. Okay, so. You guys decide I'm going to pet a cat. All right. People are yelling at me to go on the road trip. We'll go on the road trip. Awesome, man. I love road trips. You know me so well. I have a love them. They list it. They list keep going. Sounds cool, bro. I crushed some of my snacks today and I'm sad. Oh, this is really cool! This is one of my most famous attractions, the Hill of Crosses. Beautiful, isn't it? Hang on, man, I gotta get a selfie with you here. Eh? A selfie? Dude, you know what a selfie is, right? I've heard that you talk about them often. And Poland talks about them all the time. Let get with the times! Isn't it just a picture of yourself? I'm not really best at keeping up with it. Smile! Oh, okay! So, why are all these crosses here? Well, after Russia conquered me, people started praying here and putting crosses here. This place has bowled those numerous times. I'm proud that it still stands today. Now that's dedication! Yeah, <laughs> yeah. My people were pretty persistent. So I was like, don't worry, I got this, and I totally tricked out Angus car. It looks so awesome now, but he doesn't think so. Ungrateful Limey. Bleh! No crumbs! Sorry, God dang it. I finished up a snack. <laughs> I'll show you a picture when we get back to the car, but it was so totally cool. Better than that boring piece of junk that he had. England is rather simple, so some people like things more simple. And then I told England that, Whoa, what is that? What is what? That, it looks like a really big animal den or something. <sighs> this... No way. What is it? It's an old bunker from the Forest Brothers days. Huh? Forest Brothers? A few people in Estonia, Latvia, and I decided to fight a bit against the Soviets in the 1940. The Forest Brothers wanted independence and Russian rule was not something they wanted to go back to, and they thought that the molotov Vrpintrop Pact was unfair. They took out thousands of Soviet soldiers and fought to free the Baltic states. Obviously, they were unsuccessful, but they were a serious threat to the Soviets. They were a bigger part of Estonia's history, since he had legends like Ansa Terrible. Now I ended up with the most casualties, like I always did. But we were just tired of waiting for Western soldiers who never came. So we decided to do something ourselves. Dude, that sounds totally sweet! 
I've got to make a movie off of this. Are there any left? There are about 200 left in my country, and they all receive pensions now. But for those who are caught receive punishments worse than being deported to Siberia. Yeesh. You want the one side? Are you kidding? Of course I do! I want to see the place where these heroes fought for those commie bastards! Right this way. My boyfriend's name is Sassy. Mr. Comic Person. A lot of the stuff looks unusual. I would not trust sitting in one of these chairs. What's this? Oh, it's on the floor? Uh, are you okay? I'm fine. Economy. It looks like a family photo. I remember him. Alfred us. He didn't make it. He died very slowly and painfully. Oh, I'm sorry. Everyone knew what they were getting themselves into when they signed up to fight the Soviets. But I should have stopped them that we did. I took it too far. I guess I just never gave up hope. I never realized I was in a hopeless situation until a third of my population was gone. I guess I just don't know when to quit. Hey, a true hero fights to the bitter end. Even when there's no hope left. They always fight. America. You lost a lot, but you never gave up. And now you're free. A lot of people still got freedom after giving up though. Some never even put up a fight. But what would have happened if you just gave up? You're well known for not giving up, right? Hero not only never gives up, but recreates other heroes with their deeds, inspires others to do heroic things. Lit X literally everything he's looked at. Gosh dang it. You held your own, and I bet before Russia tries to invade you, he's going to remember everything you did, and he's going to think twice about it. Thank you. This sounds really cool. I'd like to hear more about your war stories. Really? Hell yeah! Mine are boring. I've been to fun places, but I've never met the fought the Kami face to face. Maybe if you stay an extra day. I would like to show you something, but most of my best battles were in Latvia and Poland. There was this one battle, the Battle of Grunwald. That one was my favorite, but it's all the way in Poland. Maybe someday I could see it. Huh. Yeah, maybe. Okay, I know you're going to love this. Dude, can I open my eyes yet? Not yet. And we're here. <gasps> Holy crap, dude! It's the House of Pants! Yep. It's just like I saw on TV! Dude, this is amazing! I think there's more interesting things to see than that, but if you like it... It's so cool! Oh my god, it's a house covered in pants! Ah, ha, ha. You never fail to amuse me. It's just a house covered in pots and pans! So, what do you think of Panamune Castle? You have a lot of castles. It's just, I wish I had castles. <laughs> oh, we're here. The hell? You said you wanted to know more about my battle history. This is where the Battle of Medic Medinin Medininkai happened. Ooh. I remember I was right here and I struck Presser right off his horse. Ooh. It was part of his crusades. I was struggling at first. This is the first battle I won. He was trying to convert me to Christianity. I was the one who he never defeated. I fought them off and kept my paganism until I got unionized. Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Marriage will do that to you. I guess so. Those were the days. This is before you were born, though. This is so cool! Can you do a pose that you probably made here? 
like this. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> perfect! Medininkai. Thank you. Where are we now? Kalnas. Is that your capital? No, my capital is Vilnius. But this was my capital when I lived with you since Poland had Vilnius, because Poland's a dick and likes to take my capital. So, where to verse? Oh, well, there's so much to see in Kalnas. If he likes my war stories, I should probably take him to the fortress. But the castle is one of the biggest attractions and is one of my best castles. The castle is older and less depressing. But he's seen like eight castles today. Hmm, do you want to see? What do we want to show him? The Countess Castle, or do we want to show him the fortress? Poland's a trap, gushing. Before I open up these other snacks, I have to finish up the mochi. What is it? No. I shouldn't be eating so much sugar before I go to bed, but. Mm. Mm. Green tea, red bean mochi. Okay, now people are saying more fortress, so I'm gonna go to fortress. Hmm, what's that? The fortress is so massive, so huge, it couldn't in be entirely put to use. It was so big that the Tsar said, There is no calmness, only fortress. <gasps> what are we waiting for? Let's go! Whoa, this looks so cool! This is only part of it. Remember, this thing is huge and old. This is only the sixth part. The so one and five are not that interesting. Six is my favorite. I just like how it looks. Too bad it's full of water. This was built for Russia? During the Empire, yes. Then Germany had it, then I had it up until I lost my independence again. And the Soviets controlled it for a year until the Nazis took over. Then the Soviets got it back and now I have it. Wow. Want to go in? Isn't it flooded? Follow me. Plebeian. <laughs> I'm kidding. Whoa! Echo! Echo! Woohoo! <laughs> How many of these are you planning on taking me to? The biggest attractions are seven and nine. Why? I like the other one more. I do too, but I have the, the, these, those who have a lot of history. What kind of history? Very dark history. Nazi history, Holocaust history, so Soviet history. No, I didn't know you were forced into the Holocaust too. Yeah, this was place was used to massacre 50,000 people. Oh, I'm sorry. Knowing that, are you sure you still want to go in? Just for a bit. People like to pay their respects, that's why 7 and 9 are so popular. What about eight? Huh? You talked about all the others, what about eight? <laughs> it's completely submerged underwater. You have to scuba dive to see it. Oh, let's do that! People actually do that. Yeah, it sounds fun! America, it's November. We would freeze to death. Oh, yeah. Plus, we don't have any gear, and I know from experience that drowning is not fun. You've drowned before? During the Revolutionary War, I fell off the boat like an idiot. Ah, I see. Dude, the view up here is wicked! <laughs> That's why I brought you here. This tower is like ancient, it's so cool! It used to be bigger. It's not really that old and it's not really in the best shape. It almost collapsed this summer. This is amazing, man! 
I'm so glad I finally got to see your house. Thanks for inviting me. Oh, you're welcome. My house is really nothing special. So, hearing you say that means a lot to me. <laughs> eh? Oh wow, oh, cool, someone is lighting up fireworks. It's like someone knows we're here. Woo, fireworks! It really is, isn't it? I think I have something really important going on this week. I can't remember what it is. What did I schedule? Going on vacation. We hey, have a flight to catch tomorrow. It's so nice that America invited me to his nice vacation home. I can't wait. Uh, I see what you did there with the Fortnite pun. It's been a long time since I went on a warm vacation. Guess really needed to take a break from working so hard. It really is sunny here. Lit! Hey, Lit! Ah, oh, America! Welcome! Welcome to my home! Oh, thank you for inviting me. Again. Thank you for being here! My boss is having a big convention here and I really didn't want to be bored. My pleasure. I really need to take a break. I haven't had a vacation like this in years. Well, you're going to enjoy this, even if it's only for three days. Beach by my house is incredible, man. We could swim every day. I'm really glad you came. Oh, no, no, no. I completely forgot. I completely forgot that bottle. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Okay, calm down. It's okay. You haven't had an episode in years. I think three days without Val humans will be okay. What a great sunny day today. Weather is really beautiful. Get your swimsuit on. We're going to the beach. To swim? Yeah, that's what you do at the beach. Yeah, what's wrong? Didn't bring a swimsuit? Oh, no, I didn't. It was probably stupid of me. It's okay, bro. You can just borrow one of mine. Oh, okay. You don't look happy, man. What's the matter? Oh, it's nothing. I'm just, um, I'm not a big fan of beaches. You can't go to Florida and miss the beach, man. The golden sand, the cool water, the babes and bikinis. You're coming with me. Well, I guess it can't be helped. America's right. The beach was beautiful. The sand is warm, the ocean is blue, and oh wow, there are a lot of beautiful women here. Does the swimsuit fit you well? Oh, yes. Thank you for buying me one. I'm sorry I couldn't fit into any of yours. That was no problem. I had no idea you'd be so thin, though. How do you do it? Do what? Stay sexy thin! I don't know. Check that. Oh, 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 gay, oh, oh, gay, 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 gosh dang it. I'm trying to catch up with your comments. Maybe it's because I work so much and I forget to eat, or maybe it's because my medicine suppresses my appetite. Dude, how do you even, how much do you even weigh? I don't know, I think I was about 60 kilograms last time I checked. What's that? Oh, right. I think that's about 140 pounds, I'm not sure. Holy shit, that's really skinny, man. How are you so thin? I honestly don't know. I don't have much time to exercise, and more than 25% of my population is overweight, but I'm not one of them. No matter how much I eat, I still remain almost underweight. I think it's my medicine, probably the Zoloft. Well, I work out all the time, and my weight doesn't change. It's not fair. I think you're gaining weight in muscle, not fat. Anyways, it's swim time! Alright. I need to finish applying the sunscreen, though. Do you need me to get your back- No! I mean, I'll keep my shirt on. Thank you. Dude, this is Florida! Even the people who are out of shape are shirtless! I'm kind of insecure about- Dude, I've seen you before. Besides, it's not like you're overweight. And you know how I'm in, how I'm in love with your way of undressing. From a comic. 
Yep. They get burned very easily. You never used to. Things change after 90 years, America. All right, man, why'd you say so? Now let's swim. <laughs> I'm not the best at swimming. Oh, jeez, you're like England, you can't swim? I can swim, I'm just, but I'm just not very good at it. I'm just trying to read all your comments, but yeah. The turning, putting chemicals in water, turning the frogs gay. <laughs> That's okay, man. You don't have to go deep. Like this. You're about my height. You'll be fine. Water well, isn't too bad. It's really nice temperature. I'm not sure about these waves, though. So. Just let the waves take your body, man. It's fun. I'm not so sure about this America. Dude, it's totally safe. Kind of fun. Kind of relaxing, too. Whoa! <laughs> that one- that wave almost went over my head. <laughs> Salt water in your mouth. America, I can't really stand anymore and these waves are questionable. Hmm. Maybe a little bit. Maybe, maybe we should. <laughs> America, look out! I can't see anything. Which way is up? I'm trying not to panic. But, because I know I can't breathe here. How long am I going to drown for? Hours? Days? Salt is burning my eyes. I'm not drowning. I can't... I can't breathe anymore. I'm losing my consciousness. Let! Let! Come on, Let! I know you can wake up! The radio, please don't die on me, man! Lit, thank God you're okay. Okay, maybe not so okay. But you're alive. How, how long was I underwater? I don't know, about 15 minutes? I don't know, I was panicking. Thank you. You were right, I shouldn't have pushed it. I'm so sorry. Your shirt got caught on something, so I had to rip it and... I'm <laughs> what matters is, I'm here now. Thank you, America. Trying to read the comments, yeah. Here, America, thank you. How about we just go home? Yeah, can you stand? I'm fine. Okay, maybe I need a bit of help. Here. Thanks. I probably should shell her off before I go, though. Yeah, me too. So much sand on my back and in my hair. I'll help you with that. Uh oh, thanks. Yeah, drowning is not fun. Thanks again for saving me back there. Wait till marriage. Gosh dang you. You guys are just... I don't even... The comments gotten have gotten tamer. I will admit, for now. Thanks for sa again for saving me back there, dude. I'm the hero. It's kind of my job. Oh, some of this really does sand really doesn't want to come off. Ow! Ow! America! What? Am I rubbing too hard? Sorry. I forget I have super strength sometimes. And oh. Hmm. Dude, since when do you have scars all over your back? <laughs> America, I... It looks so badass! The... Badass? Yeah, dude, you gotta tell me the badass story when we get back. Did you get them from like, an epic battle or something? Oh, I'll tell you the story when we get back. 
All right, man. I don't have any scars since I'm not that old. Man, this, this is why I have short hair. <laughs> yeah, I've been thinking about getting it cut for a while now. Well, I think it looks good on you, but isn't it a hassle? Not really. It's not that long. Mm -hmm. What the? How did I get here? No, no, no! I I have to be quiet because everyone else is asleep. A slip. No, don't please leave me alone. Stop. Lithuania, Lithuania, please wake up! America. Ow, thank God you're awake. Uh, what happened? Your eye, are you hurt? Yeah, that's kind of why I woke you up. You slugged me in the face, man. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to. It's fine. You look like you were having a really bad nightmare or something. You were kicking and screaming and stuff. I'm really sorry. This usually doesn't happen anymore. I'm really, really, really sorry. It's really warm. Could you get me some water? Of course. My pajamas are still stuffy. No wonder why I'm so warm. Here. Thank you. You never told me. How did you get these? 90 years is a long time to be away, America. Things happen. People die. They couldn't... They couldn't do anything. Was it him? Yes. Nightmares, scars, everything changed because of him. I'm sorry. Don't apologize. I didn't know this was going on. If I did, I... I should have come sooner. You waited for me for so long. All of you. Czechia. Slovakia. I promised I would help, but I was too scared and focused on outdoing Russia that I... I was too scared to do something. Some hero I am, huh? America. Helping me would have meant the end of the world. There was nothing you could have done. Yeah, I guess. Besides, I've had so many things going on. To drop all that for a little country like me wouldn't have been worth it. Huh? Don't say that! Whenever I hear you say that, I... I hear Lithuania, Russia's servant, instead of Lithuania, one of my best friends. You're important to me. And I don't want you to think that you're not important. America. That's why, whenever you're in trouble, I'm going to be there to save you now. Thank you, America. But what about when you're in trouble? I can't do anything to protect you. It's not fair. I care about you so much. And you give me all these things and provide me with all the support. But I can't give anything back. Mm. In fact, the gay quarter starts coming. Ah, oh, Christmas is coming up, and once I don't have to work, and what do I do? I don't know, I have no plans, and I have no friends. I'm going to America's party. And I like going to America's parties. I'm really cl close friends, and the party is always fun. You can't catch me, gay thoughts. Yes, we can! The party is lively as usual. Monica has a poker table, France is flirting with all the women, Turkey and Greece are fighting, just like every year. I'm not sure what to do. We're gonna find America. I should go find America. It is his party, after all. 
But I have no idea where to look. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Oh, hello, egg eggster. Oh, little Wayne, how have you been? I'm... Get lashings of ginger beer for everyone. I'm British, you know. I've been well. How do you know where America is? I think he said he went to go get some more decorations from the basement or something. I don't know. Ah, oh, thank you, England. America? America, are you down here? Maybe he already left? Huh? That noise, it came from the closet. Is that America? Is he trapped? Does he need my help? What should I do? Do we open the closet? Or do we not open the closet? I'm gonna finish this mochi while you guys decide. You think America's in the closet? Oh, well, not that way. This determines the ending you got, by the way. I'm gonna save. Because I want you guys to see the under other ending of this. I'm gonna open it. America? Oh, oh shit. What happened? I feel so numb. My whole body feels numb and tingly. <laughs> oh, there's the pain. It's flooding my whole body. Oh, 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 it hurts. Where am I anyways? Everything is all right. This isn't my house. Where the hell am I? Um, and I wish I had painkillers. Or my old antidepressants. Basically the same thing. <laughs> what was it? Oh. Am I in the hospital? Did I get drunk and get hit by a car again? Oh. Mm. I really, really need to stop drinking. I need it this time. Wait, Greta, you what? Shouldn't you be asleep? Wait a second. Oh wait, no, it's six a. It's like about six a.m. where you are. Never mind. <laughs> Lithuania, uh, America. Oh, ow! We need more painkillers. Holy shit, are you okay? What happened? His face is red. Has he been crying? Holy shit, man, I thought you were a goner! Uh, America, that hurts. Sorry. I just thought you'd never wake up. But what do you mean? What happened? I'm in the basement, and all of a sudden I hear you calling me, and then I hear a shit ton of stuff falling over, and I look, and I... And all the stuff from one of my closets had spilled everywhere, and you were underneath it all. I had to dig you out from all the heavy stuff. You were unconscious for the whole day, man, and I... I'm just so happy you're okay. I was unconscious for a whole day? Yeah, I was worried you wouldn't wake up. You really scared me. I'm sorry. You almost died. I don't know what I'd do without you if you died like that, man. Eric is crying. It's been a while since I saw that. Alright, yeah, have fun in Berlin. Berlin is very fun. I'm sorry about the groaning. It all just sounds so sexual. <laughs> I wish he didn't worry him so much. 
I'm sorry I worry you so much. You mean a lot to me, Lit. Okay, which one do we choose? I'm just gonna pick the first one since this is a... Uh... Okay, actually no, it's kind of besides the ending. Uh, but not the exact ending you get, but yeah. It's just, it just how things play out, I guess. No, the Me Too was the Russia route. <laughs> Get the joke. Okay. R really? Like, y you mean a lot, a lot. Like, I really like you a lot. And I think you're just such an awesome person, and I miss you, and... I want you to live with me again. <laughs> As a housekeeper? As a friend? As a partner? Oh, I'm sorry, I thought that, that it's silly of me. I'd be happy to live with you as a. Skew uh... the fangirls! Skew them! America. So, is that a yes or a no? Oh, yes! Absolutely, yes! I want to listen to the song, but I can't because copyright. Fuck your copyright. This is my bride. What are you talking about? Make babies fuck you. <laughs> oh, this one doesn't have a skip credits button, damn it. And on this very day, thousands upon thousands of fangirls screamed and shouted in delight. Now, oh yeah, it's for the non-closet ending. One second. Wait, gosh dang it. All right, we're gonna do the non-closet ending first. We're going to uh, stay in the closet this time. <laughs> that sounds weird. We're gonna not open it. I'm not going to snoop through America's things. Lithuania? Ah, oh, America. There you are, England said that you're in the basement. Oh, well, I do need help with these cups. Do you think you'd help? Yeah, I can help. Thanks, man. Well, oh, that's a lot of people here. Yep, even Russia came. Russia's Christmas isn't even until the 7th of January, though. <laughs> Yo, Jack, what's up? Uh, Merry Christmas, America. How come he never says hi to me? Because you're not nearly as cool as me. That's not true. He just didn't see me. Hello, Slovakia. Who are you again? <sighs> Come on, I want to show you something. This is going to be a long night. And I said, America, you know it's like two in the morning here, right? I forgot about time zones all the time. Man, it really sucks when all your friends are in another time zone. Oh, tell the story about how you ended up going to Mongolia to help Belarus find Russia. This is actually a reference to a fan that I bind. <laughs> These cupcakes are really good, America. Another reference to a fanfic. Thanks, Estonia. All right, so Russia ran to China to get away from his sister Belarus. So pretty much, so he pretty much threatened me. So her, 
if I can't fucking read. Alright, so Russia ran out to China to get away from his sister, and so Belarus pretty much threatened me uh, to go with her since I apparently was the last person to see Russia. So there were no direct flights there to China, so the fastest way was through Mongolia. Lithuania! Hello, Hungary. CAR hasn't been the same without you. You should come. FCAR, former communist against Russia. It's part of the anti Russia club. Well, most of the meeting involves me arguing with Romania and Slovakia getting drunk. I'll try to come next time. I'm sorry. We need to position her a bit better. I'm planning on visiting you sometime. Eh? Really? Yes, I find your history very interesting. Other than the museum of genocide victims, any place that you recommend? Well, it depends on if you're going, just going to Vilnius or you're seeing more. I can give you a tour sometime if you like. Really? That would be cool. Thank you, Lithuania. No problem. Oh, I was talking about the Belarus story. Anyways, I tell her she should have dressed lighter. So Prussia is bragging about his five meters, and Hungary says more like five centimeters. I don't. Oh wow, I don't remember laying that line. Holy shit, man! <laughs> you really didn't have to stay and help me clean up, man. No, no, it's fine. I, I like the help. It's part of my Christmas tradition to clean everything on Christmas Eve, anyways. Really? Yes, it's tradition to clean everything before the meal. You've told me a lot about your Christmas traditions before. Remember that time you had one of your Christmases here? Yeah, that was very nice of you. It was cool to see all your crazy traditions. I didn't know there were so many. People in my country don't really have many traditions, unless they're immigrants. Uh, I really do miss having you around the house, man. Mexico just isn't you. Out of all the people that have come to work for me, you are my favorite. Really? Yeah, definitely. I uh, uh, don't know what to say. You look tired, man. What time is it? 3.09 a.m. Oh, wow. You should probably get back to your hotel. Yeah, I guess I should. Hey. Hey. Hey, guys. Huh? I thought everyone left. I thought so, too. America. Belarus? Hey America, I was I was wondering. Why are we not friends and stuff? Is she drunk? I mean you like the death penalty. I love the death penalty. <laughs> it's like we should be friends, right? It's because you stand for everything that isn't democracy. Uh, yeah. Yeah, she's drunk. Well, Lydia, I didn't see you there. You little Belarus. You look tired. I am. Um, why are you so tired, Ed? Because it's three in the morning. It is? Oh. I'm trying to read the I'm going to read the comments now. Exotic butters. Ah, uh, yes. I'm, okay. What do we do? Okay, this determines the ending. So, I'm gonna have you guys pick that. <laughs> While I read the comments. Go home, Belarus, you're drunk. Drunk fellas are the reason am I, I am alive. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Okay. Okay. We're gonna call a taxi. I'm gonna save this here.
I forget which one is what. Actually, I'm gonna take her back myself because I because I just want to see. I want to see this ending. She's staying at the same hotel as me. I'll take her back. All right, man. Stay safe. Good night, America. Sleep well, man. Good night. I miss spending time with America like that. When I'm with him, I just... I feel like I don't have any problems. Everything that is bothering me disappears when I'm around him. Do I... Do I have feelings for him? Does... Is he the one that makes my kokoro go doki doki? Living with America was heaven on earth. It would do anything to have that again. But... Do you feel the same way? What would I say to him? What if it ruins our friendship? No, I can't back down from this. I need to talk with America, and I'll do it tomorrow. Oh yeah, the people who played this know the route. America? Mr. America? You're doing some greeting? I do it for you. Oh no, it's just a rare share greeting. I can handle it. Literally, um, in the Japanese version, they literally just speak a bunch of English. America, we need to talk. Come on, I know you're home. Them boxers, though. I use them for boxers and swim trunks. Eh? Lithuania? What are you doing here? America! Why is he in his underwear? It's the afternoon. Hey, listen. If there's something really important I need to tell you, I thought it would be best to tell you in person. Right now isn't really a good time. Hmm? I'm kind of in the middle of something. Wish you told me if we're coming over. America, are you coming back to bed? Give me a minute! <laughs> yeah. So, what was it you wanted to tell me? N Never mind. Dude, just ignore him. You're all the way here, just tell me. Just forget it. Man, I, I said forget it. Keep it together, come on, keep it together. Man, please just tell me. I said it's too late, America. Too late? For what? Oh, do you, you, can you like that lip? The one time you read the atmosphere right. That, I mean, oh, shit. If I would have known that, I would have never gotten together with, wait, you feel the same way? Well, I did, but at the party, you just seem so into Belarus, and I didn't think you were into men, much less me. And after the party, England came back and told me how he felt about me since I thought you didn't like me. Why didn't you tell me sooner? I, I don't know, I guess I was really nervous at the party. I didn't realize just how my strong my feelings were until I left. The comments, though. Put, bro, put some pants on. I mean, I'll read the comments after the scene. Oh, I'm such an idiot. I'm really sorry, man. If you'd have told me sooner, I would have said yes, but I understand. I'm going to get going, though. Lit, I'll see you around America. Lithuania, wait. I, th I said goodbye, America. I don't like really much UK, US, UK either. I was going to put in a Maripan, but it just didn't seem much in character. Stupid America. You were wrong. I'm not a hero. Because in the end, the hero gets the one he loves. Copyrighted music. Okay, now I'm going to read the comments while I... Uh,
Roll IO React. All the correct codes are going. Uh, top 10 plot twists. Bro, put some pants on. He a thought. He a thought. If she breathes, she a thought. He got the Florida up in England's day. No. Cries and gay. Oh, well, it's uh, rather late. Hmm. Yeah, it was, it was originally going to be a Maripan, but it just seemed kind of out of character for Japan to uh, say that line. I was thinking, who would say that line? I guess England might, so okay. I don't like Yusuke either. That's the point. <laughs> You're supposed to feel rejected. It's not gay when it's a three-way. The honey in the middle, there's some leeway. Uh, Will dies again. There's always a sad ending, at least one sad ending in each route, at least. Unless it's like the one route people. Lawton, Lawton, England shall burn in hell. United Thoughts of America. Mm -hmm. He's a total thought. <laughs> the thought, uh, the amount of thought comments, Alfred. Th fuck. The amount of thought comments are just. Thought rejected. Proud got twice. It got me heartbroken with both. Oh boy, uh, it's getting late, so I'm just going to end this. So, yeah, I hope you liked it. <laughs> Don't take it out on England. He didn't know. Oh uh, yeah, I should probably um take care of that other thing. I need to delete the other things, so yeah. No, yeah. I've got 122 views, and it only lasts 30 bloody seconds. Well, I guess it retained audience attention, but anyways, uh, until then. Wait. Uh, oh, wait, no, I end the stream here. I forgot.